Okay, let's get started. Uh, good morning, everyone. Welcome to the Design Automation for Structural Engineering class. My name is Tomasz Fudala. Uh, I'm, a tech, um, I'm a structural engineer. I have been working for Autodesk for 12 years. Uh, I have the structural engineering background and my area of expertise at Autodesk is structural engineering. I mean structural design, analysis, code checking, as well as uh, detailing and fabrication. I, I'm really passionate about computational design, uh, about Dynamo, especially how it can be used to automate engineering work. Uh, I'm a, a BIM enthusiast, a Revit API and Dynamo coder. On a daily basis, you can find me on the official Revit blog to, uh, that I run together with my Autodesk colleagues, as well as various uh, social media uh, channels if you would like to reach out after this uh, class. Before I get started, I have a really quick question for you. How many of you create or use Dynamo scripts on, the, on, on a daily basis? Please raise your hand. Okay, not so many. Um, but I hope you know this session encourage you to, to give it a try. It's not for beginners, just to give you a hands up, it's more for intermediate users who already know what Dynamo is and what it does, but uh, hopefully you, um, you will find this uh, session useful. During today's session, uh, you will learn how to uh, apply design automation techniques on your structural designs. Uh, I will walk you through a um, few uh, structural design automation um, packages uh, available uh, in Dynamo for you. So basically, you will see how you can automate uh, modeling of uh, reinforced concrete details, steel connections, but not only, uh, we will also have a look at automation of modeling of analytical models that can be used for, um, for analysis. Uh, analytical models in, in the Revit environment as well as in the robot structure analysis uh, professional environment. So four, four packages uh, we will be looking at. The first one is called Structural Design Package. This is, this is the package I, I developed. Um, it's my baby. And the next three ones are official um, Autodesk packages. For this class, you can find some additional materials. You can download a handout, almost 60-page document with detailed instructions how to create some scripts that we will be covering during this session uh, um, from scratch, basically. So to have a better understanding what's going on in these scripts and how to create your own scripts for, for your other problems. Um, these scripts that will be presented during this class can be also downloaded. Once you download the structural design package in uh, the installation uh, location, you can find the extra folder and all these scripts can be found there. These scripts uh, were prepared to be ready uh, to use uh, with Dynamo Player. So if you are just a beginner, you can try, you can give it a try to open the scripts uh, simply in Dynamo Player uh, and try to run them, you know, making, you know, selection, execute scripts, etc. cetera. Uh, okay, so let's start with Dynamo Player, what it is, what it does, what are benefits of, of Dynamo Player. So if you are a Dynamo user, you know that running a script from Dynamo can be confusing for someone who doesn't understand Dynamo. So that's why um, Dynamo Player was, uh, was developed, was introduced to be a kind of uh, 